Hello and uh, welcome to Saki Tech. So in today's video what I'm going to show you guys is how to install Ubuntu Linux on a Nexus 7 device. So I have a Nexus 7 device here and I'm going to install Ubuntu onto this little guy and I'm going to walk you step by step on what you need to do. So there's a couple of prerequisites that you must accomplish before you can proceed. Uh, number one, <clears throat> now remember as of now to install Ubuntu on a Nexus 7 you do need a desktop or a laptop running the actual Ubuntu Linux. Number two you will need to have this Nexus 7 unlocked. So both of these uh, things I have a video for and I'm gonna put a link in the description section so you can follow the instructions. Okay, just to, just to um, summarize. So number one, you have to unlock Nexus 7. So Nexus 7 must be unlocked and I will have a video link at the bottom in the description section so you can follow the instructions. It's pretty easy. Number two, you must have a laptop or a desktop with actual Ubuntu operating system running on it. And then I'm going to put another link to a video where actually uh, I show you guys how to do that. So I, I, I show you guys how to install Ubuntu Linux on a laptop. But then you can use the same process to install this on a desktop. Okay, now that we know all that, uh, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to start the installation process. So give me a couple minutes, I'll be right back. Okay, so here's my Ubuntu laptop right here. And by now, I'm assuming you guys unlocked your Nexus 7 and you have an Ubuntu uh, desktop version running on any computer. And then, of course, you need the, uh, the USB cable, the micro USB cable that we're going to use to connect this to the Nexus 7. Now, before we do anything, before we connect the Nexus 7 to our Ubuntu laptop, I have to unlock, I'm sorry, I have to put the Nexus 7 into the fast boot status. So how we do that is I'm going to tell you right now. And here's my Nexus 7. And make sure your Nexus 7 is in the boot loader mode. This is the boot loader mode right here. As you can see, let me just bring this closer up a little bit. Zoom it in. It says fast boot mode and the device is currently unlocked so this is exactly what you need to see when you load into a bootloader mode now you have to load it into the bootloader mode before you connect the Nexus 7 to the laptop so how you do that is you press you you shut off your device and then you press power volume up and volume down all at the same time and this is what you will load into once you're loaded into this and the device that is unlocked and that is in the fast boot mode then you can connect this to your computer and we can follow the remaining instructions okay so finally I'm at my uh, laptop and my laptop is running Ubuntu and my Nexus 7 is in the fast boot mode and it's connected to my laptop okay so we have all the prerequisites out of the way now what we can do is we can launch the terminal on the Ubuntu desktop. All you have to do is click this button right here where my mouse is hovering and type in terminal in the search box and then you'll get this terminal right here. And I want you to ignore all this stuff right here and look all the way at the bottom. There are three commands you're going to have to type in. One after the other. And uh, <clears throat> I'm going to put them in the description section below. And they're probably going to be hovering on the screen a little bit. So <clears throat> just do them one at a time. Okay? And what we're doing is we are, um, we are getting the software package that is going to allow us to install Ubuntu on the uh, Nexus 7. It's called the Ubuntu Nexus 7 Desktop Installer. Okay? So, <clears throat> in fact, the this is the first command that I'm going to have you type. It starts right here and ends right here. After you type this command exactly as it is shown here, 
you press enter and remember the same command is at the bottom in the description section below okay so press enter it's gonna ask you to press enter to continue so press enter and something happens and uh, now you have a, a portion of the package that you need the second command that you're gonna use is <clears throat> sudo apt get update and you can see it right here okay so that's what you type in you press enter and you get a bunch of updates to what you just downloaded Okay, and that is done now the third command is just give me one second here this one okay so that's going to be sudo app get install ubuntu nexus 7 installer so that is right here starting right here all the way here so type this exactly as shown this is the last command to be run press enter and you're done okay now we're gonna go to the next step now at this point I forgot to mention one thing make sure the only device connected to your laptop or your desktop through a USB port is your Nexus 7 device and nothing else okay so this is the final step and this is easy you go back to this dash home page right here uh, the button I mean click it and type in Nexus and this is what we just downloaded as we were typing into the terminal this is what was being downloaded so once uh, once you're here you just click launch and it gives you a, a notice forget about that uh, click agree and then it wants you to it's asking you what exactly you want to do if you look carefully it says you have the option to install Ubuntu core for Nexus 7 where you can exit so in my case I want to install Ubuntu core for Nexus 7 press OK and it's telling you the Nexus 7 installer will download the images and it will install the images on the device okay and this is a development release so it's not going to be super super stable okay and just one more time please it's, it's verifying please connect your device in fast boot mode which just to remind you is this this is the fast boot mode okay ready to begin the installation yep okay so the image is being downloaded and let's see what happens this is the first time I'm doing this whole thing so the downloading process continues and I just want to let you know this may take some time okay so this is a waiting process I'm gonna cut this video obviously so you don't have to wait you know whatever many minutes it's gonna to take to download this device okay so I'm back with the video it looks like we're almost done here so I'm gonna keep this on, on um, online now it's actually extracting so we'll see how long that takes Okay, pop your password in. Okay, so it says beginning the installation. It's erasing my partitions on my um, Nexus 7 right now. And it's flashing the, <clears throat> the root file system. Nothing has happened on my Nexus 7 right now. It's just sitting in the bootloader mode or the fast boot mode, but it's being flashed. Reviewing those tests. Seems you passed. Okay, so that that is complete. So it says Nexus Seven. Right now, something has happened in Nexus. I just want to. It's, it's rebooting. So well, nothing is happening, so to speak. But um, it says Nexus Seven flashed with Ubuntu Core successfully it will take several minutes for the root file system to be unpacked and installed after reboot so just to show you what's going on with my um, uh, Nexus 7 right here something has happened on the top here so let me just 
Okay, so it's saying exactly what it said on the screen. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video here and I'm going to be back as the process completes. Now remember, everything we we're supposed to do, we did. Don't disconnect your device at this point. You don't disconnect your Nexus 7 from the laptop right now. Just uh, keep looking at your Nexus 7 and see what happens. Uh, so far, like I said, all I see is that tiny little writing on the top. It's blinking. It's going to take several minutes. And I'll be back once I see something else happening on my Nexus 7. Okay, so the routing is completed. Uh, I mean the flashing. The flashing is completed, so now the Ubuntu Core is on my Nexus. And if you look at my Nexus carefully and read what it says, let me just zoom in on this. It says, preparing the root file system, please wait. This will take a few minutes, and I'll be back in that few minutes to show you what's going on. Uh, it's probably going to just go straight to the installation screen on a standard Ubuntu machine. So just like you installed Ubuntu on your laptop, you'll be installing it on your on your Nexus 7. And you can use the touch screen to, um, to do that. Okay, so after that blinking little line that was blinking up here, uh, this is what it booted into. So it looks like Ubuntu is on my Nexus 7 right now. So let's keep watching this, see what happens. Show you the full screen here. Okay, let's see if it flips over. Just, just wondering. Okay. It's a little lot of whack here. <clears throat> but I'm just going to continue pressing what I'm supposed to. So it's English language. Let's go this way. I, I doubt you're supposed to see it this way, but so you pick the English language, you click next, continue. And then you can pick a uh, Wi Fi if you want to. I'm just going to skip it for now. Click continue. It says I don't want to connect to the Wi Fi right now here. So I think I press continue. Okay, and it wants you to pick the um, <clears throat> the region you're in. It's New York. Continue. <clears throat> now this stuff here, I don't know if this is normal or not. Oh, there's a keyboard that just popped up. Okay, it wants me to pick a name, so I'm just going to do test. This is a test system, so it gave me a test laptop as a username. Um, a password, I'm just going to do test. test click continue and as you can see it's saying installing the system so Ubuntu is being installed right now and like I was saying this stuff right here I don't know if you're gonna see it or not but I don't know why I'm seeing this uh, maybe it's normal but so far so good it's it's doing what it's supposed to it's actually installing and the barcode is moving okay so we're gonna leave it alone and I'll be back when it's all completed Okay, so the bar fully loaded and we're back into this screen. It disappeared. It's probably going to come back up. Let's see what happens. There we go. So what it's saying right now. Okay, it's saying it's applying the changes. Let's click details and see what it... Okay. As far as I can tell, it's supposed to be this way probably. See if it flips over. Okay. We'll keep it like this for now. Okay, looks like we're restarting. And hopefully this time we'll have a normal screen. And there we go. We are, in fact, logged in to Ubuntu. And this just looks like, look, let's go back to my laptop real quick. I'm just going to show you. That's my laptop right there. Okay. And this is my Nexus 7. And they're both running Ubuntu. And I can click the screen. Right. 
if I want to type something there's a keyboard button at the bottom here that I can bring up I don't know how to do that I'm gonna be back with another video where actually I'm gonna show you what it is like to run um, Ubuntu on a Nexus 7 so thank you for watching this video guys and I hope you enjoyed it if you have any questions put it down in the comment section below and if you like the channel just subscribe to the channel click the like button if you liked this video it was helpful to you and go ahead and share the video with your uh, Facebook friends you know just click the Facebook button down there and uh, you know, if you have any friends that are trying to install this uh, get this running just you know let them know and uh, thank you for watching have a good day guys